want to go into artist management. There are people I'm really excited about. I'm working with this group that signed the Interscope. Going into that and helping people build their brands. In five years, I want to be just like this, humble and cool, and just allow my career to do what it does on its own. I want to do something that people wouldn't expect from me. I think there's so much more I can do. I think there's so much more that I need to do and achieve and, and see and experience and, and fail. I think I need to fail so much more so I can learn so much more, you know what I mean? I want to be my version of Scooter Braun. You know, I, I want to be able to have great talent, great artists I'm working with, and at the same time, have something that's probably on TV. I want to play a part in hip hop. Like, I want to be able to be one of them dudes that stood up for something or that stood for something. It's just to start to something dope, something real dope. Some of the artists that I looked up to, Bone Thugs, man. I say this all the time, that was really like my inspiration, just the style. Well, I have a heavy uh, admiration for the mid 90s, early 90s, you know, whether it's music or just how people dressed. Well, I looked up to, to Lil John, the Dr. Dre's, the DJ Quick, the Manny Fresh, uh, Swiss Beats, Timberland. I am inspired by people's hustle by people's motivation, by people's creativity. I just pull from anything that I grew up admiring and try to translate it in the way that a young kid will understand without even really having to know the meaning behind it. To be a trendsetter, it's not following the rules, it's setting your own rules. When I was growing up, skateboarding was not cool. Streetwear was not cool. It was opposite. I was an outcast for being a skateboarder. This was in on my plan, you know, like this was in my life plans. I never said I wanted to be a photographer when I grew up. I never said I wanted to be published. I never said I wanted to shoot TV. I never said I wanted to do video. I've loved photography since I can remember. I used to always take my mom's camera and take pictures of whatever I could, whether it be my dog, my lowrider bike. Being the trendsetter means to me, you create what people follow. You don't like go jump on bandwagons. You organically get people to follow and to mimic what you do in a positive way. I feel like I'm creating a lane for uh, artists to be themselves. I guess it's refreshing for people because we're so used to the typical things from young cats. Everything is so late for everyone else to catch on to, but if I'm in the position to be able to offer something that's genuine because that's what we grew up doing our whole lives, then hey, I'll take it. Go get it. You, you do what you, you do. You go get it. So I uh, cruise about to go up, I'm about to head in. 